In this video, I'm going to talk about measurement, specifically capacity. Capacity is the amount of liquid a container can hold. If you think about it, there's containers all around us. We have water bottles, milk jugs, even the car you ride in has a container to hold the gasoline. We're going to talk about the customary units of measurement for capacity, not the metric system. So the smallest unit for capacity we're going to talk about is the fluid ounce. It's about as small as it gets. The next thing you're going to have from a fluid ounce will be a cup. And the cup, that doesn't mean a drinking cup necessarily, it means more like a, like a cup that you use for baking. Um, one cup has eight fluid ounces in it, by the way. Then there's the pint, then the quart, and the gallon. And I'm going to show you a way to draw this guy that we call Gallon Man, which will help you remember all of this. And so here he is, here's Gallon Man. It wouldn't hurt for you to learn how to draw this. His head is a huge G, and that stands for gallon, because the gallon's the biggest unit for capacity we're going to talk about. So the gallon's the biggest thing, that's his big head. Inside the G, you'll find these four Qs, and these Qs stand for quarts. So what that tells us is that there's four quarts inside a gallon, meaning if I had an empty gallon jug and took four quarts of water and poured it into the jug, it would fit perfectly. Inside each Q, you'll find a P. Those P stands for pint. And you'll find two peas. So what that means is that there's two pints in one quart. Now, how many pints are there in a gallon? Well, if you look at it, you can see that there's two, four, six, eight. There's eight pints in a gallon. So a quart is smaller than a gallon, but a pint is smaller than a quart. Inside the pint, let's see if I can zoom in and see these C's real quick. The C stands for cup. Let's go zoom in real quick. Let's get in there bigger. There we go. Okay. So inside the P, the pint, you'll find these two C's. It stands for cups. So there's two cups and a pint. There's two pints and a quart. And then there's four quarts and a gallon. And this makes up our gallon man. So let's zoom out real quick. And here we go. So how many cups are there in a gallon? Well, now you can see that there's two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. There's 16 cups in a gallon.